Hello judges, welcome to Flat Free. My name's Stuart Wife, come on in. So throughout my career, I've built over 800 loft conversions in and around Hampshire, Surrey and South West London. It was COVID restrictions that allowed us to pivot as a company from residential developments where we were restricted and weren't allowed in people's houses into HMOs and then quickly into commercial to residential conversions. Um, I've got a young team, um, I've got 80 contractors that work for us on a daily basis and they didn't benefit from the furlough scheme so we had to move into this direction um, and with our young team of in-house architects and designers we quickly adapted our skill set um, to build this scheme out here which is where we're presenting today. So we bought this building, it was 4,350 square foot of property. We paid just over 90 pounds a square foot. It was on the open daylight market, it had a Savills board outside so anyone could have bought it but we saw a lot about using the depth of the building and the deep space um, by creating some light wells. We completed the purchase in October 2021, obtained planning and started the construction process in March 2022, completing on the refinance exactly 12 months later. In fact, the attached repayment schedule from Interbay um, shows that we, we took out our mortgage on the 1st of April this year. Um, we used our own contractors, we managed the whole build and design in-house and all the costs for the project were documented line by line so you could sh we could show the transparency to our investors plus we could use this data for future projects to eliminate bill risks such as uh, you know such as a volatile market like we find ourselves in today um, our total bill costs so we paid 400,000 pounds for this building our legals and our 106 agreements were 75,000 um, pounds the bill costs which come in at 555,500 um, we spent some green technology, which was £50,000. Um, new supplies and the disconnections come in at £46,000. Admin and professional fees were £23,000. And as we've done a project management cost, um, those costs were £75,000. So the total cost on this development were £1,224,500. And the RICS GDV valuation per flat was £1,540,000 which meant a gross profit of £314,500. Um, so we're really pleased with that result. And when it was all said and done, we repaid our investors £100,000. Um, we left our profit in the building as equity and we had to inject another £100,000 into the deal um, because we didn't realise that the Rick Surveyor was going to apply a, a multi-unit discount um, on all the block on one title, which we now know next time we'll split the titles but we were under such a rush to get this thing remortgaged as List Trust was just coming to office. The market was so volatile uh, and we managed to get a five year fixed rate at 4.99%, uh, which we're really pleased about. Um, the income of the building after our letting fees is just under £10,000 a month for all nine flats. Um, the mortgage repayment is just um, under £5,000 a month. Um, our IIR with our cash left in is 19%. The profit on cost pre-finance was 25.6% and the profit on GDV pre-finance was 20.4%. So I've also been nominated for Property Investor of the Year. Um, I really feel like I've got the experience and track record um, to represent the awards in the best light and to inspire younger people who want to get into the industry to, um, to aspire to heat, reach their goals and eventually you know, win one of these awards one day. Um, I've 100% fully invested my time and my life into property development now. And even though this deal is a nine unit scheme, I'm also working on a bank where we've exchanged with a delayed completion to build 18 new build scheme with a new office. We currently have a, a seven unit scheme in Farnham that we're building out. And we have an option on a 20 unit scheme where we are going through planning at the moment to build out all using modern methods of construction. Okay, thank you for that. That's pretty much it for that this video. Um, thank you for listening to me. Thanks for the opportunity again. And if you've got any other questions, please get in contact. I look forward to seeing you in December. Take care.